G'day guys, welcome back to another episode of Flashlight Crazy. Today I'm reviewing the Bry Knight PT16. Let's check it out. All right, here it is, the PT16. Now let's check what's in the box. All right, first things first, we've got a lanyard, nice and short lanyard, so no stuffing around there. That's, uh, that's gonna hold it in place really nicely. Now, the lanyard area, we've got one on the tactical ring here, one on the end of the uh, tail cap as well. Next, we've got this beast of a holster. So, now, that comes off like this. So, it's Velcroed. So, look at that. Okay, so, that is going to go over your belt, that bit there and then it turns. So you can have this sideways or you can have it uh, vertical, whatever you want. It's got a nice area here to stick a, a spare battery in there. Oh, it's got two actually. Spare batteries, you could put uh, a pen even, you know, so pry bar, um, awesome holster. Really love this holster, really great outdoorsman holster. And let's see what it looks like in the holster. All right, there it is. So very secure, not going anywhere. Not gonna be the quickest draw, but um, you know, security over quick draw, I think is much better. So that's a great, great holster. You also get a tactical ring. I will go over that shortly, how to install it. You get a pocket clip. I will also go over how to install that as well. Now you get your USB-C here to USB-A charging cable. That is gonna charge that charging port there. Not very deep, but it is what it is. We have two spare O-rings. Thank you very much, Brynite. And we have an advertisement of what else uh, they are currently selling. Very nice. And you will get your warranty card and your user manual. All right, I'll take this off. Now, the battery you get is a 5,000 milliamp hour, 3.6 volt, 21700, and it is a rechargeable lithium ion with a protection circuit. So it is a protected battery. Let's open this up to, whoa, to install it. Now, if I just get that happening. All right, there it is there. So that's the contact area, nice spring down at the bottom. And... Obviously, we've got a nice spring there as well. So that is fantastic. Chuck it in. All right, so let's start off with some weights and measurements. So with the uh, 21700 plus the tactical ring, this comes in at 220, wow, 220 grams, exactly. All right, it is just too long for the calipers there. So I would say this is about 150 millimeters long. Actually, just found my ruler. So how right was I? Um, no, it's a bit longer, 160 millimeters or 16 centimeters. And that's to the end of the bezel there. Now the face width is 28.86 mil, body width 16.63 mil, tail cap width 19.09 mil. So the ergo is pretty good in this. It feels really nice with the tactical ring on it. Really, really cool. Uh, now, I may as well just show you, well, I may as well just show you now. So if you don't want the tactical ring, what you do is you just roll it over the uh, O-rings and it takes a little bit of working it, but it'll eventually get there. There we go. And now if you want the pocket clip on, you obviously just attach the pocket clip and then the tactical ring has this little indent here. So you put the tactical ring over the O-rings, come on, like that, and then see how it has gone over the pocket clip there and then you screw it up. And now what I do is see how it's a bit off. So I just move it so that it is all centered so that if I've got my finger through the tactical ring, I've got access to instant strobe, but also the constant on straight away. So it's a really, really ergonomically lovely light to hold like this in the hand. I love it. Uh, now for the purposes of this review, I will put the tactical ring back on. Here we go. Good as gold. So it's a large light. It's 
got an SFT40 LED down the bottom there with uh, a very deep reflector. So you're gonna get a whole lot of candela out of that. Now we've got some, I just might zoom in actually. So we've got some uh, strike bezel-like areas on the end of the face there. We do have a side switch, so that side switch is actually gonna allow you to use the light as well, which is phenomenal. It's um, amazing to have a side switch and a tail cap switch, I really love that. Very, very nice looking light. I don't love how shallow that is though. So we'll have to check what the water resistance is and it's not a very good um, rubber flap on it as well. It just doesn't feel very secure, but we'll deal with it. Body feels really nice. Like I said, very comfortable in the hand with the uh, tactical ring. And the tail cap has got uh, clicky protectors up there. So I love that, that they, it's kind of like a half shrouded tail cap, but it does have a dual system here so that you can access instant strobe with that, or when it's on, you can access turning it up or down. Really, really cool. So cool thing about this light is when you buy it, you can buy it with three, uh, uh, three separate pack options. So pack number one is the standard pack. Pack number two is the one I've got, and that gives you your holster. It gives you your tactical ring finger as well as this tactical ring. And then uh, the tactical pack, pack three, will give you everything that I've got, but also a remote pressure switch uh, and a mount for a rifle. So that's really cool. Although actually I don't think you'll get the uh, tactical ring with the tactical pack, which seems weird, uh, but it says that you won't get that. All right, so let's go over the UI. Now, if you want to turn this light on from the side switch, you can, single click, and then single click will cycle through the outputs. So that there is your low mode of 10 lumens. You'll get that for about 16 hours. Stepping up, that's medium mode, which is 130 lumens. You'll get for about 12 hours. Stepping up again, that's uh, high, 820 lumens. You'll get for 200 minutes. And then turbo, you will get for two minutes on 2,000 lumens, that's 2,000 lumens, and then it will drop down uh, for an additional 130 minutes, but it doesn't tell you what it drops down to. Now in this light, you're gonna get 600 meters of throw, 92,000 candela. Pretty impressive. Now, if I press and hold from on, it turns it off. Single click turns it on, single click cycles, press and hold turns it off. But if I wanna lock the side switch, one, two, three, and it locks the side switch. However, you still have access to the tail cap and the strobe button. So side switch locked, tail cap unlocked. One, two, three, unlocks the side switch. And so now we've got uh, tail cap access and side switch access. Now the tail cap always comes on in your 2000 lumens every single time. I can cycle down once it's on by clicking the mode button and that will just cycle through the outputs I've gone through. But from off, the mode button becomes a strobe button, which is really, really cool. So you've got strobe in one, one button, you've got on and off in another button, forward clicky, so you've got momentary, and you've got all use in your side switch as well. Very, very impressive light, really uh, very diverse, you can hold it any way you want and you're gonna be able to use this light. So that's a real, real plus for me. Now I'm just gonna get it on turbo and do a bit of a heat test. So I'll be back in a minute and a half. All right, 45 degrees Celsius it got to. Um, it's not too bad, the body's warm, the head's warm, but it's not too bad. It's not, I'm not, you know, pulling away from it or anything, so that's cool. Now this passed the one meter drop test and it is IP68 water protected. So that's two meters water submersible. So I guess this flap does something or maybe that's just doesn't matter if it gets wet, um, but it says two meters, so that's pretty good. All right, let's take this outside, see what it can do. And then we'll come back for some final thoughts, prices and where to buy. See you in a sec. All right, there's the Brynite. And that is incredible. That is seriously impressive. Now I know I've got some car lights shining behind me, but look at that. Oh, actually they're gone now, beauty. Look at that, man. Let me just look at that. Across the field, there is nothing it won't touch. 
That is extraordinary. Absolutely extraordinary. Wow. Look at that, just lighting up that tree. Man, that tree from here is 100 meters away. That is insane. And I love the tactical instant strobe as well. Probably wouldn't use it very often, but it's, it's so cool to have it. And then it comes on in high every time. Low, medium, high, turbo. Man, that is impressive. That is so cool. Hell yeah. This would be a great self-defense slash thrower just next to the bed, ready to go. Epic, man. All right. See ya. All right, so a few pluses about this light. Number one, love that it's got a side switch. Number two, love that it's got instant strobe. Number three, love that it's got a forward clicky tail switch that you can momentary or constant on. I love the fact that the tail cap always comes on in, in high, turbo. Fantastic, 2,000 lumens. Night shots were impressive. This thing is impressive. Huge head, so a lot of candela, a lot of throw, a lot of light intensity candela. Uh, so very, very cool. Love the holster, love the tactical ring that it comes with. I really do love it. I think that this tactical ring's great because you can pistol grip, no worries. Oh, the cigar grip, sorry, no worries. But I love that it does come with a tactical ring because it's actually very comfortable to hold with that tactical ring and you can fit the pocket clip on it as well. So you can literally clip it to your belt, put your finger in the tactical ring, yoink, good to go. So that's awesome. Uh, now, Brynight sent me this for review, so I will link uh, their link in the description. Click on it, check out the price. They haven't given me a price or if there's discounts or anything yet. So uh, once I edit this video, I'll then contact them. They'll give me the rundown. So just click the link to check out what, um, what it's going for and where to buy it from. If the link leads you to overseas, away from Australia, I will also find a dealer in Australia that sells them and link that as well. All right, thanks very much for watching, guys, and until next time, stay cool and stay safe. See ya.